Hello, this week's Google Tip of the Week is related to Google Chrome extensions. Uh, so Chrome extensions are basically software programs that can help modify, enhance the functionality of different of your Chrome browser by adding different shortcuts. So what these are is these across the top right hand corner, these are some of the shortcuts, some extensions that I've added to my uh, Chrome browser. So I'm going to go through some of the best ones and how to do these. These are very simple. As you notice, I'm in Google. I just type Chrome extensions. It takes me to the Chrome Web Store. I'm just going to go ahead and select that. There are some very good extensions that I would definitely highly recommend adding. Uh, one of the first extensions is just one of the easiest one, and that's just Google Calendar. And all of that is is adds a Google Calendar extension to the top. So I'm going to go ahead and add it. So it's right here, Google Calendar. Add to Chrome. I select it. It just asks me to add extension. And when I do that, it now add the extension to that top right corner. So it's a quick and easy way to access your calendar um, really fast. And there's a lot of nice features to this as well. Notice I also have a Google Classroom extension, and that is very useful to shooting out different things to teachers. So for example, if I'm in a Google Doc, so let me go to my Google Drive real quick and show you how that one would work. I'm just going to open up any document right now. And let's see what I have here. And our computer Wi-Fi is just very slow. All right, so let's just say I wanted to take this um, this Google Doc and push it out to my Google Classroom real quick. I just go up to my classroom. It says Share to Classroom. It says Loading. And what it's going to ask me to do is where do I want to send it to? So I can send it to really quickly to any one of my quick examples. If I went and clicked on uh, Professional Development Training, for example, it pushed right out to that Google Classroom and I can hit push and it pushes it out. That's how easy it is. So if you're using a lot of Google Docs, presentations, sheets, I highly recommend as teachers who have the Classroom extension if you're using Google Classroom because it makes it very fast and easy to push those different assignments out uh, to your students. Uh, I have some other extensions I wanted to show you. I have them in an email that I'll be sending. For example, another one that's very popular is Merge Events in Google Calendar. So I'm going to go back to my Google extensions again. And I'm going to type in Mail Merge. And what this allows you to do is actually may, uh, merge your different emails for, actually it's called event merge. I want a different one here, not mail merge, event merge. I'll show you what that looks like. So event merge will take all your different Google calendars and merge them into one. So you won't see multiple events. It'll merge it into one event. So I know a lot of complaints have come in that there's just too much on the calendar. Uh, this is a nice extension that you can add that'll clean up your calendar and make things easy to read. So there'll be other um, links on my email that I'm going to send this out to with some other recommendations for extensions. I uh, hope this helps and this should improve productivity and help with your Gmail and calendar invites. Thank you.